Have you ever wondered, are the people of Japan, Korea, and China distant cousins? On the surface, Japanese, Koreans, and Chinese may look a bit alike similar skin tone, hair color, even some shared words. But when you look deeper at their DNA, things are both similar and surprisingly different. Today we explore what genetics tells us about their true relationship. In this exploration, we use modern scientific studies that compare the full genomes of people from these populations to reveal how closely related they are and how history shaped their DNA. Chapter 1. A Shared Background Ancient East Asian Roots Thousands of years ago, the ancestors of the Japanese, Koreans, and Han Chinese began migrating into East Asia from regions of Eurasia. This migration is key to understanding the shared genetic roots of these three groups. Genetic research has shown that modern East Asians, including these three populations, can trace their origins back to these early human migrations. Over time, they split from other ancient populations, gradually adapting to their new environments. According to studies on East Asian genetic history, their shared ancestry is evident in many of the genetic traits they have in common today. Some of the key genetic similarities among Japanese, Koreans, and Han Chinese include traits linked to skin tone, immune system responses, and metabolic processes. For example, certain variations in genes related to skin pigmentation are shared among these populations, contributing to the generally similar appearance of East Asians. These genetic traits have been passed down from their ancient ancestors, influencing everything from their immune defenses to their ability to process certain foods. According to research by the Human Genome Project, these traits are deeply embedded in their DNA and have remained largely consistent over thousands of years. However, as these populations settled in different regions, their genetic makeup began to evolve separately. The Japanese, for instance, settled on islands, while Koreans and Han Chinese remained on the mainland. This geographic isolation led to some differences in their genetic makeup, even as they retained common ancestral traits. Migration within and between these regions over time also played a role in shaping the genetic diversity seen today. Despite these differences, the long-shared history of these populations is still evident in their genetic structure. Studies have confirmed that even though they follow different paths, the deep, ancient roots they share continue to link them together, showing us that their ancestors were once part of the same large genetic family. Chapter 2. What Recent DNA Studies Say Similarities and Differences In 2018, a groundbreaking study analyzed genome-wide data from 182 Han Chinese, 90 Japanese, and 100 Korean individuals, along with data from other global populations. This study published in Springerlink found clear genetic similarities between these three East Asian groups. However, it also revealed that their genetic makeups are distinct enough that DNA can reliably tell them apart. While they share a significant portion of their genetic code, their differences are noticeable at the molecular level, highlighting the uniqueness of each group. The study's findings emphasize that Although the genetic distance between these populations is small compared to the differences between East Asians and Europeans, the three groups still exhibit clear genetic distinctions. This means that while they are genetically closer to each other than to people from other continents, their unique histories and genetic evolution over thousands of years set them apart. The research also estimated that the most recent common ancestor of these three groups lived approximately 3,000 to 3,600 years ago. This suggests that, despite their shared ancient ancestry, these populations began to diverge from each other around this time. This divergence could be attributed to factors like a geographic isolation, differing environmental pressures, and the development of distinct cultures over the centuries. After this initial split, each population followed its own genetic path, influenced by local factors and historical events. For instance, the migration of people across East Asia led to the mixing of genetic material between neighboring populations, a process known as admixture. This mixing further shaped the genetic diversity seen in each of these groups today. The study highlights that while they remain connected by their ancient roots, their genetic histories have been marked by significant divergence, 
making them distinct from one another. These findings reveal a fascinating story of how populations with shared origins gradually developed their own unique genetic identities while maintaining some ancient bonds. Chapter 3. Closer Kin Japanese and Koreans Several studies have suggested that among the three East Asian populations, Japanese, Koreans, and Han Chinese Japanese and Koreans are genetically closer to each other than to the Han Chinese. This surprising closeness between the Japanese and Koreans has been confirmed by genetic studies, particularly when examining markers on the Y chromosome, which is passed down from father to son. One early Y chromosome study published in Nature found that certain paternal lineage markers commonly found in Northeast Asia are shared more frequently by Japanese and Korean individuals compared to other Asian populations. This suggests a closer genetic connection between the two groups. These findings are further supported by historical and archaeological evidence, which points to migration patterns that helped shape the genetic landscape of East Asia. The Yayoi people, who are considered the ancestors of many modern Japanese, are believed to have arrived from the Korean peninsula around 2,000 to 2,500 years ago. During their migration, they brought with them new farming techniques and genetic traits from the mainland of East Asia. According to Wikipedia, this migration played a crucial role in shaping the genetic makeup of the Japanese population, creating a blend of local, earlier inhabitants, and mainland East Asian ancestry. As a result of this dual background, modern Japanese people carry genetic components that are quite similar to Koreans and other mainland East Asians. However, over time, Japan's geographic isolation allowed for the development of unique genetic traits, setting the Japanese apart from their Korean and Chinese neighbors. Despite these differences, the shared history of migration and cultural exchange has left both Japanese and Koreans with similar genetic footprints, especially in terms of paternal lineage. These genetic connections show that while the Japanese and Koreans have followed separate paths over millennia, their shared ancestry and historical ties reveal a deep and lasting bond. Chapter 4 Genetic Diversity Within Each Population While the genetic similarities between Japanese, Korean, and Han Chinese populations are significant, it's crucial to understand that there is considerable genetic diversity within each of these groups. Recent genetic studies have shown that even within a single population, the genetic makeup can vary widely. This diversity is a result of many factors, including historical migrations, intermarriage, and the blending of various ancestral lineages over time. For example, genetic research on the Japanese population has revealed a wide range of genetic variation. Some individuals show what might be considered pure Japanese ancestry, meaning their genetic markers closely resemble those of the earliest Japanese settlers. However, other individuals exhibit evidence of admixture, where their genes reflect a combination of Japanese ancestry along with other East Asian genetic traits, such as Korean or Chinese markers. This variation highlights how Japan's history of migration and interaction with neighboring populations has contributed to its genetic landscape. The same can be said for Koreans and Han Chinese. Both populations are not homogeneous, but are rather a tapestry of genetic inputs from different periods of migration and intermarriage. Over centuries, waves of migration and historical events, such as invasions and trade, have led to genetic mixing between various East Asian groups. This means that within these populations, no one group is entirely genetically uniform. The genetic makeup of individuals can vary greatly, with some showing more markers from certain ancestral populations than others. In other words, even though Japanese and Koreans may, on average, appear to be genetically closer to one another than to Han Chinese, there are plenty of exceptions within each group. Just as with any large population, individual genetic backgrounds in Japan, Korea, and China can differ widely, reminding us that these terms Japanese, Korean, and Chinese represent broad categories rather than single uniform genetic blocks. This diversity within populations emphasizes the complexity of human genetics and the fact that genetic identity is shaped by centuries of historical, social, and geographical factors. 
So, while we can talk about broad genetic trends, each person's genetic background is unique, reflecting the rich and intricate history of their ancestors. Chapter 5. What does this mean? Are they distant cousins? So, are the Japanese, Koreans, and Chinese distant cousins? The answer is yes, to an extent. These populations share an ancient East Asian ancestry, which means that, long ago, their ancestors were part of overlapping population groups. Thousands of years ago, people from various regions of Eurasia moved into East Asia, and as they did, they laid the genetic foundation for the modern populations we see today. Despite the passage of time, the genetic footprints of these early ancestors still connect these groups. However, after this shared beginning, each population followed its own genetic path. Over the course of millennia, geographic isolation, migration, and other historical factors caused the genetic differences between these populations to grow. The Japanese, for example, were influenced by early migrations from the Korean Peninsula, which gave them a distinct genetic identity. Similarly, the Chinese population's genetic history is shaped by a vast geographical area and diverse ethnic groups within the country. The Koreans, though sharing common ancestry with the Japanese, also developed unique genetic markers over time. These genetic changes were influenced by factors like isolation, for example, Japan's insular nature, migration, and the mixing of different populations over time which is known as admixture. As a result, while all three groups share some genetic heritage, they also develop their own unique genetic signatures. These differences are measurable and distinct, especially when comparing Japanese and Koreans to Han Chinese. Nevertheless, the genetic bond among Japanese, Koreans, and Han Chinese remains closer than the bond between East Asians and people from other parts of the world. This illustrates the complexity of human genetics. A blend of shared ancestry, evolutionary divergence, and historical events that have shaped the genetic diversity we observe today. In the end, the relationship between these three populations reflects the rich and intricate history of human migration, isolation, and interaction. The idea of distant cousins captures this balance between shared roots and distinct paths, revealing how genetics is a living testament to human history. Conclusion When you hear that Japanese, Koreans, and Chinese look alike, there's some truth to it millions of years ago, the early ancestors of these populations spread across East Asia, leaving behind deep genetic footprints. These early migrations laid the foundation for similarities in appearance, such as shared features and physiological traits. However, modern DNA tells a more complex story. Despite their common ancestral roots, the Japanese, Koreans, and Han Chinese are genetically distinct, each with its own unique history shaped by migrations, isolations, and cultural evolution. Among these three groups, Japanese and Koreans are genetically the closest, likely due to shared ancestors and migration patterns between the Korean Peninsula and the Japanese islands. Over time, as these populations grew apart, they developed their own genetic markers and identities, influenced by geography and local historical events. The genetic diversity within each group is also noteworthy. No population is genetically monolithic. Within Japan, Korea, and China, individual genetic backgrounds can differ significantly, reflecting a long history of migration, mixing, and adaptation. So, yes, while we might call them distant cousins in the sense of a shared ancient ancestry, their paths diverged long ago, and their individual histories have made them unique. This genetic separation highlights the complex and fascinating nature of human diversity. Yet, it also serves as a reminder that, despite these differences, we are all more connected than we might realize. Understanding this can help us appreciate the richness of human heritage and the shared experiences that link us all.